welcome viewers to the ninth episode in a series of episodes that are focused on the 2023 GCE Science Paper 2. So this is a continuation of the detailed revision to this paper. So if you haven't seen the other episode, please go to our YouTube channel, you'll see a dedicated playlist to answering these questions from this paper to the detail. And if you're new to this channel, consider hitting the subscribe button so that each time I upload the video, you get the notification bell. And if you find this video to be helpful, please consider liking and also indicating in the comment section that you're finding these videos helpful. It will help me to understand that you are finding the videos helpful. So let us look at question B5. Distinguish between an acid and a base. So in this case, we're just differentiating or comparing the two. So what is key is knowing that an acid is a compound that donates hydrogen ions, while a base is a compound that accepts the hydrogen ions. That's what is key. In distinguishing these two, we need to focus on these aspects. So, acids are compounds that so are compounds that donate hydrogen ion to another compound while bases are compounds that accept so accept hydrogen ions so that's the distinction factor the other things are properties but the question is not asking us eh, to give the properties so you need to distinguish them using eh, these critical differences which is eh, acids donate eh, hydrogen ions while bases accept eh, the hydrogen ions question B explain what you understand by the term sort so what is a sort so again here what is critical is ensuring that you indicate that the salt is a product from neutralization between an acid and a base. So salt in chemistry refers to an ionic compound that results from neutralization reaction of an acid an acid and a base this sort it consists of the positive ion which is known as a cation of a base and a negative ion of an acid so a salt arises from the fact that you have an acid plus a base reaction this will give us salt plus water as the product so this is what we are defining as it refers to an ionic compound that results from neutralization reaction of an acid and a base so it's through this generic equation so once you do this you are good to go and you get these four marks so thank you for joining me in this episode please join me in the next episode as we look at question b6